All right, so this is a uh, homemade. Actually, we built it. Uh, I guess it would be a yard trailer, dump trailer. It's uh, the decking is all uh, old oak lumber. I uh, we guessed the lumber has to be over 100 years old because the, the uh, we got it back in a field 20 years ago, and it's I mean this stuff just doesn't rot at all. So it's pretty decent wood, nice and heavy. I mean you could throw pretty much whatever you want in this trailer, and thing you're gonna, the only thing you have to worry about is those tires popping basically. Frame is solid. I mean everything is incredibly built basically. Uh, the hydraulics is all right. It's only pressure up. It's uh, you release the pressure to go down, which isn't ideal. This thing's been sitting, man, two years. We just never use it. We have a tractor, so it kind of lost use after that. Um, but it was a little sticky getting it going. The motor was a bit froze, but we had, did have a cover over it. But sitting two years, the winters and all that gets that way. Took a minute, but it did free up and works just like it. Well, it did when we left it, so battery isn't the right one. I just got the vice grips on it. I mean, you can see this is just solid steel right there just for the jack. I mean, you got big angle irons holding that on, battery box, solid. I mean, this is really thick steel there holding the pump on. Everything is just solid on this thing. The sides are all removable, uh, all three sides and ramp, it's removable. Most of the time, you just leave the ramp off, it doesn't really do much nice if you're hauling a lot of wood or something like that It'd be a nice wood trailer you can put a cover over it because of those uh canopy rods there it's kind of nice but we don't use that much either we usually have them off i do have another set of tires those are off an old camry car they're probably a little more beefy than the you know lawn tires but we have a lawn tire set for it too and if you want to get close to the ground you use those you know it sits a little bit lower when that's on there but I mean, I mean, it's a pretty solid little trip. I mean, you see, we put a lot of time into just welding these on there. We cut it off so it'd be at an angle. You know, it looks pretty professional in a lot of ways. Nice stop there. I just had to build this rod here today. Uh, we lost the other one because we took the ramp off, but uh, not a big deal. You can see all the amount of screws that we had to use on this thing. We, this used to look pretty nice. It used to be stained and uh, clear coated but obviously use and sitting outside that kind of fell off pretty quick but it doesn't matter. It's still oak. It's going to last forever. Yeah you can see how we just have little slots here. You just lift it up. I don't think we've ever had the sides off of this thing. Uh, it's just you know why. It's a dump trailer. It's meant to have stuff in it that you need to dump so it just doesn't get much use. Tires are alright. I think one of them has a leak. <sighs> nice big square tubing there. See all look at all those things. It took us forever to bolt all this on. Are no springs, so it's not really a road trailer, like I said, but I mean you could theoretically take it down the road if you deflated the tires. There's so much weight on this trailer. But yeah. I'll uh, show it running here. So basically, all you just do is you leave that on, close this, that's the uh, dump valve for going down, and you just turn it on. I'm going to dump those tires out, but yeah, whatever. That's it. That's a pretty steep angle. Pretty much anything you uh, put in there is going to come out. Nice thing is it never really comes front light. I think it's pretty, pretty well balanced. It was uh, I built the frame mainly, and my dad did the rest of it basically, the way he wanted it. It's a nice little yard trailer. We uh, used it for we put a tarp inside of it, and we used it for hauling chicken stuff around. Chickens back then. But, yeah, and you just release this. And uh, I think most of the time I'm gonna put some weight on it. Yeah, you're gonna have to put a little weight on there. But 
to go down. Uh, it's pretty sticky from sitting. He used to go down just normally. Then we got a pin down there. I don't know if you can see it, but. I mean, it's a pretty solid little trailer. There's not much to it. But, I mean, it'll haul pretty much whatever the heck you want. It'd be nice if you have a larger property that you need to haul a lot of wood or something, pile it up or whatever. But, goes to that. The reason why we built this trailer in the first place was to get through our trails in the back and the woods and stuff. Really handy for that. You know, we built it taller so it uh, wouldn't be as wide and all that stuff. So, yeah, it's just a little overview of our home built dump trailer. So, if you have questions, throw them in the comments, you know. But otherwise, I'll uh, let you go.